So unfortunately, my dad passed away a few years ago and was never able to come out here to hunt the Cape Kudu. Um, but the one way that I could bring a little piece of him along is to bring his rifle. It's a pre-64 Winchester Model 70, uh, chambered in 270. Um, it's a 1948. Um, it's the only rifle he had, the only rifle he ever used, hunted with, um, and it just it worked for him. And so he never thought about changing it up. So I thought it was a perfect gun to bring for the trip. Um, I wanted to take the original optic that he had on there too, this old Redfield. It was, I believe, it was the original one that he bought with the rifle. And Jason did convince me that I would probably need a little bit more magnification. Um, so I had this loophole on another rifle, and um, I got one of the uh, custom CDS dials made for the Winchester 130 grain ballistic silver tip. Yeah, 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 what they said. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna go. Um, you see, there's big those cows, bulls. I think the same group we saw, but uh, there must have been a bull, big bull there that we didn't see or join up below. So you see the last bull ran, they ran down to that corner there. Hopefully, crack one. Oh my god. Oh, this yeah. Fucking beautiful. I've never I've never That's seen it. <laughs> That's a rubber cable. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Good eye. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Sure. <laughs> That's a fucking off board. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> 